Welcome back to our channel. How y'all doing? I'm coming in to do this small haul. And I say small because I'm going to Sam's Wednesday. I just went and stocked up on some meat that they had on sale at one of our locally owned um, grocery stores. So, like I said, they had a really good deal. And I got a coupon. Plus, I had used my, my other son. The one that I had did, if y'all watch my vlogs. Y'all had seen that he had got married. I had used his discount. Well, he allowed me to use his discount. So I got a discount on top of the coupon. Um, and that was really nice of him. Like I said, it's like a son of mine. So, um, Gerald. So I was able to use his discount as well. So I'm going to just start here with the ground beef. I ended up getting three packs for $10. And they was five and a little bit over a piece. And I only got three packs because I still have two in my deep freezer. So I just only got three. And then I got one whole cut of chicken, a family pack of the chicken wings, and a family pack of the breast. So I ended up getting the same deal. I got three of them for $10. And that's what it came up, like I said, after the discounts and stuff. And then I got the mix and match. It's usually two for 10, but with the family discount, it was two for five. So I got one small pack of pork chops, because we really don't eat a whole lot of pork chops, but every now and then my mom would want one. And I may want one, but I'll usually just get them maybe once a month. And then I got one pack of the chicken legs, and you get a lot of them in here. So I got one that. And my mom likes the chicken back portions, and I do as well. I know it's not a lot of meat on it, but it's a lot of flavor in them. And it was 164 And then I got this pack of turkey wings. And I'm not sure the price that I got on that, but I'm pretty sure that was in the discount as well. The Manda pork smoked sausages and these smoked sausages, I think for this brand it was four pounds and it was on sale for like seven dollars and some change and usually it run around 14 to 17. And then this pack here and this one is two and a half pounds and I ended up getting this one for four dollars and this is usually around seven. And then I got the Ziegler Southern style smoked sausages. I got four packs because the kids like to make these for breakfast or you can put them on a grill or do them as skewers and these taste really good and these are a dollar and fifty cent a pack so I went on and got four and they will go through these pretty quick and then the Ziegler pork sausages um, just the regular meat I do like to cut these up and do them in like an egg and potato casserole and then I got one of the Purnell old folk sausages um, country sausage and these were 99 cent a pack I sh and um, I should have went on and got more but I just got these and if I see some I know sometimes Sam's have these in a bigger roll I may get two if not I'll just go back and get them because that sale will last through Friday uh, Saturday and then I got this roll which was um, 21 ounce and I think that was like 250 for that roll a pack of hot links the little scissors was on sale for 89 cents and y'all know these usually run a lot these used to be only a dollar at Winn Dixie way back in the day but that is way back in the day so I got four of these because if they're not eating those they like the little scissors a pack of cheese I just got these two packs of butter just for baking and cooking because when I do go to Sam's I'm gonna get that big um, packs of butter because it'll last me for a month and a half. Two things of Hawaiian Punch. But this, um, the Hawaiian Punch, I'm gonna tell you guys what came from Dollar General. The Hawaiian Punch came from Dollar General. I got two of them, the blue one and the orange. And with my coupon, I ended up saving $20 with the digital coupon. Plus I had another coupon that I didn't use Saturday. The Snapples, and now they come in plastic bottles. They was on sale, 25 cents a piece. So I got four of them. I got two sprites. Well, I'm not gonna say on sale with the digital coupon. They was 25 cents a piece. And I think I got five because I opened that one up. I already got it over there on my stand. That's what I'm drinking. I got two sprites, but I got two of the Canada Dry ginger ale and the Seven Up. And if you get three, you got them for 50 cents a piece. 
and I don't know how long that's gonna last so I don't want to tell you guys anything by the time y'all see it but I know with these it was a dollar a piece if you get them without the digital coupon and then like I said I had an extra customer coupon from Saturday but I know I got each one of these for 50 cent a piece because I bought three the lemonade I got from there they was a dollar with the digital coupon I got two the strawberry and the lemonade and I think that's all that came from the oh and then I got the two Liptons back there that came from Dollar General and that was it. My lactate came from the grocery store, so I get the lactate milk for Philip because he can only drink these in his Pediasures. I got one red diamond tea, and it was on sale, but I can't remember the price. I got two of the Prairie Farm chocolate milks, two of the Turkey Hill lemonades, two gallons of regular whole milk. The peanut butter and jelly stripes did come from Dollar General. The pork and beans Campbell's. These are the one pound or the 3.75 ounces, and they won't sell for 50 cents. So I grabbed four, and I might go back and get four or either six more because they like Philip likes to eat these with hot dogs, and Talia does as well. And the bigger cans will last longer. I got the baby llama or butter beans, and then I got the large. I got one bag of the dry blue runner beans and then the regular camellias for some reason if you guys live here in the south and y'all get the blue runner the whole beans you guys let me know if y'all get the fresh beans do these take longer to boil than the camellias because to me the camellias you get them done like it used to back in the day but the blue runners seem to take a little bit longer so i don't know um and maybe it's just the ones that we have. And normally I will let these soak. I usually don't have to let these soak. But for these, I have to let soak. That's the only way they won't take as long. So if you ever see me get the Blue Runners, that's why I get them in a can. Because they are already seasoned. And you can just add your own seasons. But they are good. Um, but between the Blue Runners in the can and the fresh Camellia Red Beans are the only two that I prefer. When I do the fresh, I like to get, I'll either get the Zatarans. Or I'll get the, um, I can't think of the brand that I get, the red bean seasoning. And I always cut up my Trinity when I make my beans, but this will just give you extra seasonings. And the same thing that they put in these, they put in the Blue Runners when they cook them. And that's just a little side note, you know, for those of you guys who don't know. <laughs> just a little side note. I got two things of garlic powder. They was $0.25 cent a piece. And I got two of the onion powder. And all of this came from Fubles. A pack of Zatarans. And I'm going to start getting my rice from there. Because this rice is $3.80 for the 5 pound bag. And at Walmart, it is like $5 a bag. So I'm going to start getting it from Fubles. I just got one 10 pound bag of sugar. The New York Bakery Texas Toast. The real garlic. The 16 slices. And this was $2.50. I got the Jimmy Dean Sausage on a stick and they were six dollars but when I go to Sam's I will pick up the big two big boxes for Philip. The corn, I got the 24 year corn, two of the Red Baron Classic Crust because that's what the kiddos want to eat today. The extra cheesy pizza Lunchables with the Capri Sun and the candy. These was 50 cent you guys. And you know they're regular like a dollar ninety nine for the most part but they were 50 cents and the expiration date on these is like the end of July, July 28th. But these will be gone before then. So I got seven. Alicia can take these to band camp and Philip and my little niece will eat them. These, because today's Monday, these will probably be gone by Wednesday. And then these are the other two Liptons that I had told you guys about. It's the Lipton Peach Iced Tea and the Lipton Green Tea Citrus that came from Dollar General. And I know just on the digital coupon. Sorry about that, you guys. I got to clean out my space. My space is running out. That never happened to me before. Um, but, yeah, I got the peach iced tea and the green citrus tea with the digital coupon app. They are $4, but I had an extra coupon from it from, again, Saturday, and it ended up saving me an extra dollar, so I ended up getting them for $3 a piece. I got 124 case of Cokes, but these did come from Frugals, and y'all know Cokes are usually between like six and seven dollars at Walmart or Winn Dixie, but at Frugals they always run four ninety. That's just the price they always have them at.
And what else? I don't even remember if I mentioned my bacon. But if I didn't, this is the Sugardale bacon. I got one. I got one 24 case of water from Dollar General as well, and it was $2.50, but with my coupon, not the digital app, but with the coupon that I had, it was $1.25, and, but it was only limit one, so I just went on and got one because I, like I said, I will be going to Sam's and stocking up on my water, my vegetable, my water, frozen vegetables, fruit, and like Powerades and stuff like that, you know, all of my more healthier products or whatnot, I'm going to Sam's and get that on Wednesday. And I got one pack of 30 count bowls and the 44 plates. And these were 50 cent a piece at Frugal. And that will pretty much do it for my haul, you guys. I'm going to go ahead on and get my meat and stuff put up in my freezer. My milks and stuff put up in my refrigerator. So I thank you guys for watching. I hope I did not keep you guys for too long. I will be back Wednesday. I will be vlogging while I'm in Sam's and I will do a Sam's grocery haul. So again, thank you guys for watching. If you have not already subscribed, please go ahead on and hit that subscribe button and that bell so you will not miss any of our hauls, vlogs, or anything else we got going on. And also, if you're interested, please go over and check out my other channel. It's called Alicia's Life and I will write it up somewhere at the top, up here somewhere, but it's Alicia's Life. Y'all please go check that out. And I will greatly appreciate it. So thank y'all. And I will see you guys later. Bye y'all.